Hello friends! So, is your cooling fan running at full speed all the time even when the engine is cool? The P0495 code stands for Cooling Fan Speed High. This basically means the engine control module, or ECM, has detected that the cooling fan is running at an excessively high speed when it shouldn't be. If left unchecked, it can cause unnecessary wear on the fan motor, reduced fuel economy and electrical problems. Common symptoms of P0495 are, the check engine light is on, the cooling fan runs at maximum speed constantly, the engine takes longer to warm up, there's unusual noise from the fan motor and you might notice reduced fuel efficiency. If you're noticing these symptoms, don't ignore them. Okay, so to diagnose a P0495 code, you'll need to locate a few key components under the hood. First up, the cooling fan motor. You'll usually find this right behind the radiator, mounted in front of the engine. Next, let's talk about the cooling fan control module. This is typically located near the cooling fan itself, though sometimes you might find it inside the engine fuse box. Alright, let's talk about the coolant temperature sensor, or CTS. You'll usually find it near the thermostat housing or sometimes right on the engine block. Now, moving on to the engine control module, or ECM, it's typically located under the hood or in some cases behind the dashboard. Next up are the wiring and relays. These run between the fan motor, the control module, and the ECM. Oh, and here's a handy tip. If your car has more than one fan, make sure to check all of them to ensure they're working properly. Alright, so let's talk about some of the most common causes behind that P0495 code. First up, a faulty cooling fan control module. If this part is malfunctioning, it might, you know, force the fan to run at full speed, even when it's not really needed. Next, we've got a defective coolant temperature sensor, or CTS for short. A bad sensor like this can send incorrect temperature readings, which can definitely mess with how your fan operates. Third, a short circuit in the wiring can actually cause the fan to stay on all the time. This means that uh, there's a problem somewhere in the fan circuit that's making it run constantly. Fourth, a stuck fan relay is another common issue. If the relay is faulty, it could keep the fan powered at high speed, even when it shouldn't be. Fifth, sometimes the engine control module or ECM might be sending the wrong signals, which, you know, can also lead to this problem. So, how do you actually fix a P0495 code? Let's go through the steps you need to take. Alright, let's dive into the first couple of steps. Step 1, you'll want to use an OBD2 scanner to confirm that pesky P0495 code. It's always good to double check, right? Now, moving on to step 2, inspect the cooling fan motor. You need to see if it's running at high speed even when the engine is cool. That could be a sign of trouble. Okay, let's keep going with step 3. Test the cooling fan control module and be on the lookout for any burnt spots or damaged components. It's crucial to ensure everything looks good there. And finally, step 4, check the coolant temperature sensor or CTS. You'll want to use a multimeter to test its resistance. It's a pretty straightforward process, but it's important to get it right. Alright, so step 5 is to inspect the wiring and connectors. You want to look for any short circuits or damaged insulation because even a small nick can cause issues. Next, step 6 is to test the fan relay. You can swap it with another similar relay and see if the problem still happens. It's a simple way to rule out a faulty relay. Now moving on to step 7. Go ahead and reset the code, then take your car for a test drive. Just clear that fault code and keep an eye out to see if the problem comes back. So, the P0495 code is usually caused by a bad fan control module, a faulty relay or sometimes incorrect temperature sensor readings. Fixing this issue will boost your engine efficiency, help prevent battery drain, and make sure your cooling system works just right. For more car troubleshooting guides, check out these videos next. P0250, fuel pump control circuit open, and P0251, injection pump fuel metering control A. And hey, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to IG Garage for more car repair tips.